Hello. In this video, I will be going through our graduation webpage, as well as details on how to request a graduation invitation support letter for your family members for the commencement ceremony. To get to this graduation webpage, you can first start on the International Programs and Services, also known as IPS, webpage. If you scroll down, there are boxes on the left-hand side, and you will go into the Resources tab. From the Resources tab, there are many options towards the bottom of the page, and you can see that there is a graduation button. If you click that, it will bring you to our graduation page. <clears throat> if you are watching this video because you have completed your degree at Michigan Tech, congratulations. We know this is a very exciting time for you and your family and friends, and we want to make this process as smooth as possible for you. So there are a few more details that you will want to take care of regarding graduation. If you click this link right here, this box that says find graduation resources, this will bring you to the registrar's office page on graduation. International Programs and Services does not handle anything pertaining to graduation other than processing the support letter. And so you'll want to refer to this webpage and the registrar's office for any questions you may have. As you can see, there are many different resource options on this page here. There is information regarding applications. There's information regarding ordering your cap and gown. If you have questions pertaining to the commencement ceremony, there is also a section on this. For diploma information, diplomas are mailed to the address on your graduation application. And so that information can be talked about with the Student Services Center in the administration building. There is also a section on residency requirements, which talks about how students must meet specific residency requirements in order to be eligible to graduate. And so all of these requirements are listed at the link right here. Moving back to our webpage. Again, it reiterates how the registrar's office has important graduation resources, such as commencement instructions, ordering a cap and gown, and details about receiving your diploma. Where IPS comes in is if you are looking to invite guests for your graduation ceremony. We do have a graduation invitation support letter Google form that you can fill out if your family is planning on coming for your graduation. If you are looking to invite more than one family member to the commencement ceremony, you will need to fill out this Google form for each individual guest. We say to allow for a couple business days for processing these letters. And so we will email you with these letters when they are ready. Since we use a mail merge for these Google Forms, you want to make sure that you are accurate in your responses with spelling as well as capital letters because how you enter the fields in the Google Form will be exactly how it appears in the letter. So please be sure you proofread your entries before submitting. To open, the Google form, you can just click that button there. It will ask for your email. It will ask which family member you are planning on inviting to the ceremony. Please note from this list that there are no friends allowed to be invited with our support letters. We only process these support letters for visa appointments for family members. You will then enter your family member's full name. You will then enter what your relationship is to that family member and then your full name as the student, as well as your gender. Here you will enter degree information, such as what degree level you are and your major. For your family member, you will select what title they are. You will then enter your Michigan Tech email address. Then we'll ask you what semester you are planning on attending the commencement ceremony. We know that visa appointments are far in advance in the future, for a lot of countries. And so if you are filling out this Google form and the semester that you are planning on having your family come for your commencement is not here, let us know and we can add the option for you. You will then want to add the semester and year that you had graduated. Please note if you are attending the commencement ceremony a little while after you have already graduated and you are now on OPT, you will still want to indicate the semester and year that you had graduated. Again, you will put your first and last name in these next fields. And then at the end, you will select yes to acknowledge that these letters are not required by the government and they do not guarantee visa approval. 
So with that being said, IPS will only issue electronically signed letters as we are moving a lot of our processing to electrically signed documents. If your family member would like the physical copy, you can just pass these emails along to them and they can print them from home and bring them to their visa appointment. That is what we would recommend that they do anyway. At the bottom of the screen, you can also see some other opportunities for after you graduate. We would recommend to make sure that you stay connected to your Michigan Tech family. And there are a lot of opportunities on how to do so. For example, you can try to find mentors, classmates, and friends through the Michigan Tech International Alumni page. As you can see, this is another web page that is outside of international programs and services because this is through the alumni and friends web page. So if you scroll down, you can see some options in which you can stay connected, whether that's through mentoring, recruiting, or even just looking through social media and having some interaction with other international student alumni. You can also share your Michigan Tech memories that you have and much, much more. There is an alumni and friends group that also tries to do their best to have recruitment and social events for alumni in different cities in the country. And so I would highly recommend going to there if you have any option to do so. Again, on the resources tab on this side, you can see that Michigan Tech International Alumni page linked here, as well as the link to request the graduation invitation letter. If you do have any questions on this, again, you can visit our website. Otherwise, we would recommend reaching out to the registrar's office as they handle most things pertaining to graduation and the commencement ceremony. Thank you for watching and have a great day.